Whoa! <laughs> There's so much slow mo. Oh my god! It just went through his head. <laughs> the camera. The camera <laughs> just panned through his head. We saw like the teeth of the model. Why would he do that? <laughs> we, the camera just passed through the character model. Hold on, out of the way, lady. I got a lamp. The lamp meta goes crazy. All right, do I, is this a lamp chair yet? Okay. All right, I got my lamp chair. God, these controls are like so much worse than you like. It's it, it's indescribably bad. Like it's just awkward. Like I feel, almost feel like there's an input delay. All right, guys, how's it going? We're gonna get started here. Uh, I've actually played this game before, back when it came out. Even back then, it was so bad that I quit for something. I don't remember why I stopped. There was something that happened that was so frustrating that I just quit. And I, I cannot, I can't recall what that was. So we're gonna, because that was years ago. So we're gonna find out together. Uh, but uh, this game is gonna be so bad, it's fun. I remember, like, it's just funny. I, like, it takes itself so seriously, but, like, the voice acting's terrible. The story's nonsense. The animations are bad. Like, there's just, like, a lot of unintentional funny things happening. On a scale of 1, 10, 10 being horrible, how bad is is it? We're about to find out. Look at me. Hello. Sir, I can't help but notice that this I'm not alone and uh, it's not particularly dark in here. Blink to clear your vision. Not too scary now. Wait, do I can I do this for the whole game? Press R3 to blink? We've got blinking on command. I would not be surprised if this started off as like a different idea and they're like, let's just call it Alone in the Dark. Or they were like, uh, we just want Alone in the Dark game, uh, make whatever you want. Th I know the game is in third person for the majority of it. Maybe I'm wrong. What the fuck was that? Ow. So who are, what are you doing, bro? Stop. Stop kicking me. I'm. Oh, I can't go. Where do you want me to go? Wait, what's happening? I guess we wanted to go this way. Sorry, I thought we were going. To the elevator men. Let me open it for you, cold How, Move. dear God, please tell me I don't have to blink like this. Into the, right. the entire game. Why does my vision get blurry so quickly? This way. Do I have to? How often do I have to do this? Go right. Wait. No. Ah! Oh dear God! All right, at least I don't have that guy pushing me around now. I can like go wherever, but I still have to blink. I have to. Dude, manual blinking is a terrible idea for a video game. Oh yeah, I remember they made a big deal about like their lighting engine. They do a lot of w dumb light stuff in this game. All right, now it's third person. Okay, you can switch to first person view. Do I have to blink still? I mean, I can blink. Well, let's stay in third person so I don't have to manually blink. The true next gen feature of manual blinking. All right, square is jump for some odd reason. Ow, okay, don't do that. I know it's called Lone in the Dark, but uh, I actually can't see what's going on right now. Dark is in the name, but uh, a skosh too much. This was made in a time before OLEDs, so... Wait. You can rewind? Wait, what? Episode 1, Blackout Sequence 1, Wake Up in a Strange Room. You can fast forward? You can just skip ahead? I have never seen a game offer a chapter select before you finish it. <laughs> That's so weird. Do you want to get this over with? We have the tools for you. Alright, we got some Uncharted. Uncharted changed everything. Nothing was ever the same after Uncharted, dude. It broke the brains of so many developers. They were just like, oh, fuck, dude. <laughs> we gotta include the rope swinging now. Horror game? No, no, no. What if it was dark Uncharted? What if it was Uncharted, but, like, spooky? <laughs> oh, fuck. I, I, so why do you swing that way? I'm just holding down. He was like, I don't know, I want to touch the lightning really quick. I want to touch the lightning. Dude, look at this. Calm down, honey. You Please, think you can do no, that sir, for me? you have to help us. Anna. He's in there hurt, on, and baby. I can't Please. get him out. I need your help. Have you seen the walls? They're alive, like in nightmares. They open up and swallow you. I swear I saw it. Anna, hey, just stop. relax, and we'll find a way out. We'll, uh, find a way. This running animation is so bad. Whoa, whoa there. You can grab furniture to move it around. Specifically furniture, only furniture. Anything that's not furniture, no way. We got some home decorating. Some interior decoration simulator. Fire extinguisher. Oh, that's cool. I mean, well, that, that's, that's interesting. It's like a compartmentalized 
fire extinguisher. It's living up to the inferno name. Hold L1 to lock on. Use the extinguisher to break the door. Am I locked onto the door? What's the deal with this building? I'll see what I can do. I'll see what I can do. Smash. Wait. What? You use the analog stick as melee? Who thought that was a good idea? What? Urgh. This all momentum based. It's like, Urgh. Urgh. which button makes you lock in? <laughs> That's the button they don't have. Where's the lock in button? Everyone's always talking about locking on. I'm trying to lock in. But yeah, this did look bad even for 2008. Oh god, dude, the screen tearing. Holy fuck. Why? Why is there so much screen tearing? What else can I pick up? Oh, this chair? Oh, bro. I'm running the chair meta for as long as I can. For as long as they'll let me. Oh my god, now my chair's on fire. Fuck. Put out, put out, put out, put out, put out. Watch out for those flames. Put up. I'm trying to put out my chair. Fuck. Alright, fine. It doesn't seem to be... Okay, well... Ow! We'll have to run the chair meta later. Probably should take the fire extinguisher. As much as I love running chair metas, this is probably better. Shit. God damn, I know this is alone in the dark, but I can't see jack shit. I hope we get a flashlight soon. This is basically Power Wash Simulator, but instead of water, it's, uh, it's coolants. Instead of things that are being power washed, it's, it's fire on the ground. Oops. Square is jump. Why is square jump? Oh, motherfucker, I gotta, I gotta do this again. Why would the checkpoint not be after the door? After the door is smashed in. I'll see what I can do. There we go. I saw what I could do. I just saw another of those what I could do is bash in doors. For a game called Alone in the Dark, I, I can't help but tell that I'm not particularly alone. Do, do fire extinguishers have infinite ammo? Can I extinguish infinite fire? You can't jump with heavy objects in your hand. Oh, okay. I don't know what they're gonna do. Me, on the other hand, I'm gonna... Let's do slow motion jumps over a, uh... Over a pit. What, what's going on? Just... <laughs> what is happening? <laughs> Why did that just slow motion drop from the ceiling? What is going on? It's just like slow panning. Is this supposed to happen? Makes the scene more intense. I can't move. I think... I... I think it's... I think I'm... I think it glitched. I think I'm just frozen. Okay, finally. Okay, everything's still in slow motion. Oh, it's because I'm technically like... Oh my god. It wasn't supposed to be in slow motion. I didn't like clear the... You will. There's no other way. I can't get over this. Technically, I didn't make the jump, so I was still in the like in the area where the game like denoted was like the slow motion zone. So it slowed down the entire cutscene. All right, we made it. We made it over, Goaty. All right, pick this up. Have your jacket to check the items you've collected. Oh, that's cool. You know what? Uh, points for creative inventory. I do like that. Okay, here I'm gonna combine bullets with gun. They do combine. Okay. That's a winning formula. L R one to shoot. Okay, what? Am I shooting the lock off? What am I? Sh oh yeah. Oh cool, dude. Destructible doors. That's actually. You know what? Points for that too. That's cool. Like yeah, you can just shoot the lock off the door or shoot the the door part off. I don't know. If, I don't know if that's literally how that works, but you know, like I'll points for that. What? Did he just roll out of a pit? When injured, you need healing items to treat your wounds, okay? And where do I get one of those? I'm taking this chair with me. The run with the chair is so funny. We're running the chair meta for as long as I can. Is there any first aid to pick up? What I need is a fucking flashlight. Ah. Flashlight comes on out of nowhere when I open up cupboards. That was like a refrigerator door, dude. When I opened it, there was like an internal light. Switch into healing mode. I love switching to healing mode. Use additional spray to treat wounds that are not 
uh, Hemer hanging? Wounds that are not Hemer hanging. What's a Hemer hanging? Whatever. I, you know, this is cool ideas. They got some cool ideas here. Hemorrhaging. Oh, okay. Sorry. Wait. Is that hemorrhaging? Hemorrhaging. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, dyslexic. I was like, Hemer hanging. Hemorrhaging, yeah. The words did some flip-flops on me. Whoa! I was definitely under that rubble. Oh my god, dude. It, this is uncharted. Whoa! <laughs> There's so much slow-mo! Oh my god! It just went through his head! <laughs> the camera! The <laughs> just banned through his head. We saw like the teeth of the model. Why would he do that? <laughs> we, the camera just passed through the character model. Michael Bay ass cutscene right here. The polish is astounding. What? What it? Sir, grab this cable. It looks like it's got electricity running through it. Are you sure? I guess. I don't know if this was a good idea. Do some more uncharteding right now. Hey, you all right? You're not wounded, are you? Square is jump, but you press circle to jump off the rope. Out. Okay. <laughs> Dude, these animations are so good. <laughs> Bruh. Bruh. All right, what, what's going on here? What do I do? Do I just drop? Like, what's. Can't pull myself up. Maybe over here? Oh, god damn it. I hate when cars break the size of buildings. I was gonna use that. Alright, now I can climb up. Hmm. The rats know the way. Damn. Uh, he tanked that, though. Bro tanked, like, a, a bunch of falling rubble. I was kind of expecting it to... Uh, that's to be a game over. He just he, t he took the hit. I love how it's like the texture gets so blurry if you look at the bottom of the screen. The draw distance on that texture is abysmal. Grabbing onto more live electrical wires. And there's cool ideas that are like the opposite of polish. They got the game to uh, be playable from start to finish, and they're like, ah, we're done. That's good enough. But like, you know, cool ideas nonetheless. Uh, I like how you can land perfect landing. I like how you can physically see like the wounds on his body and stuff like that's cool like representing damage on the character is a cool idea. This wasn't supposed to be a horror game like this whole uncharted vine swinging thing is like pretty cool. Things are so stiff. Everything is just like it's just like they just animated it going straight down, basically. It was the city amid. As far as the eye could see, everything was very mediocre. But, uh, our mouth movements weren't fitting our words. Our animations were stiff, and our textures were far too shiny. Well, I can look at it. It looks like everything was just coated in gloss for no reason. Why is there no audio? Why is there no sound effect for that? What was that animation? Why is there no sound effect? And why was it in like kind of slow motion? This game had great graphics for its time. No, it did not. I was I was there in 2008. It this did not look good even for 2008. That <laughs> is not true. This is Alone in the Dark Inferno, released for PlayStation 3 and 360 back in the, back in 2008. It is one of the worst horror games ever made. Okay. Okay. What what does it want from me? 
What? What's it asking? Okay, there's a fire extinguisher. Oh, wait, okay. I think I'm starting to understand what it's asking me to do. I think I'm starting to pick up on the code it's putting down. Move this out of the way. I have to unhook it from that. What I... Do I have to... I'm sorry, what? Extinguisher? What about the extinguisher? Oh, I get the extinguisher so I can... Oh, so I can bash the thing. Right, okay. Do I just bash this? There. Oh, you're saying use it like an elevator. Oh, okay. Oh, it's like a dumb waiter. Oh, thank you. All right, okay. <laughs> oh my god. It's also it's so funny that it just it stays up perfect. It just balances upright. This is so stupid. It's a it's a fire extinguisher. He could have just thrown it up onto here. It's not that heavy. He needs to do this whole dumbwaiter situation. Now that I could pick up my fire extinguisher that was sitting perfectly upright. It was time. It, oops. It was it was it was time to God damn it. Okay, first person is easier. It was time to put out the fire and do what I do best. The innovation. <laughs> With these innovations, what used to be a simple task of putting something up on a ledge now can be alleviated with the power of of this <laughs> of this uh, dolly system I've created. I'm living in the future, baby. They're all living in the past, moving stuff with their hands. It's at least 35 pounds, maybe 50. Wait, really? You know how heavy fire extinguishers probably weigh? Oh, no, I, I had no idea. I guess I've never really picked one up, but I know. He was wheeling it around easy enough earlier. Be careful, you're tearing down my cable. I'm never gonna be able to get internet at this rate. Oh, uh, with how much uh, is in there must weigh a ton, that's true. Yeah, I guess infinite extinguishing abilities would weigh a lot. Hell yeah. <laughs> the leap, the way that he lands, it's like with no momentum is the funniest thing to me. There's no weight, he just like lands perfectly on his feet. Yo, the lady, I helped from downstairs. Everything going well? Are you having a lovely day? Your balcony's got debris on it, you might want to clean that off. Hold on, out of the way, lady. I got a lamp. The lamp meta goes crazy. We should find Jack. He's one of the hotel's watchmen. He'll know what to do. <laughs> Actually, you know what? On second thought, I don't think the lamp's working. So I have a gun, but I'm not gonna waste the bullets opening a door. There we go. I opened the door. Lydia, I'm gonna need I'm gonna need you to get together. You're gonna complain about every floor that falls out from underneath me. We're never gonna get out of here, because this this whole building, I don't know how else to tell you this, is collapsing. I I would, uh, but I'm I'm currently under the collapse floor. You could have come down here. Could you, now you, now the, the wall you're one of the wall now. You're part of the collapse floor. Oh yeah, all she did was complain. Where you know what? I need I need doers, not not complainers. I need people who are going to think of innovative solutions, like moving desks. Whoever this is, move desks so that Joel could move dumpsters in uh, The Last of Us. Truly an innovator, alone in the dark. This is the revised Inferno? The OG game was worse? Wait, what? You're telling me Alone in the Dark Inferno was not the original game? Did they just release a game called Alone in the Dark? Inferno was PS3 only? What? Oh my god, I didn't know this was a full-on re- Have- Dude. They gotta start subtitling these. Every time Alone in the Dark comes out with like another reboot, they're just like, we're starting fresh. This is Alone in the Dark. And it's like, there's like seven of these games. They're all called Alone in the Dark. I had no idea Inferno was like a remaster. What was the original like? Kind of like a year after the Wii and 360 one first. Is this Leon? Yeah, this, this might as well be like Leon in, in 30 years. It's a very similar looking jacket. Like, if, if Leon bleached his hair brown and uh, picked up chain smoking, this would be him. This does look a lot like his jacket from uh, from 6. What, what was different? What were the other differences between this and the uh, other one? Game is much darker. What was there less fire? 
What? Hey, what the fuck just happened? You okay? <laughs> he just teleported me. The fire was not so bright. The Wii was a completely different game? Okay. Is my chair on fire? Because I want to use it as a lamp. Alright, yeah. Dude, look at my lamp chair. Hell yeah. Fuck! Damn it, lamp chair! Alright, is this a lamp chair yet? Okay, alright, I got my lamp chair. God, these controls are, like, so much worse than you, like... It's it, it's indescribably bad. Like, it's just awkward. Like, I feel, almost feel like there's an input delay. Ow! Ow! What's happening? Oh my god, my lamp chair! My lamp chair's attacking me! No! Betrayed my lamp chair! No! No, the lamp chair got his revenge. Hey, are, are you okay? You okay there, buddy? Uh, I gotta be quicker with lamp chair. You seen those fissures right. too? Man, what the fuck are they? I gotta, I gotta the be cautious about lamp chair. All right, there we go. Just gonna magnetize that ledge, but that's fine. Whoa! Oh God! Who are you? What have you done to her? She's one of my hosts now. As you once were, you, my most perfect puppet. Wait. <laughs> they really treat this like a TV show, dude. There's, uh, they're playing credits right now. You can't really see on the TikTok screen, but there's just credits playing on the sky of the screen. <laughs> okay, I know we always watch the credits, but that's ridiculous. We've been playing for... Uh, less than an hour. It was episodic, but it was released on, all at one time. It's not like it was... This is before, like, digital infrastructure was good enough to, like, have, like, weekly or monthly episode episodic drops. It came on one disc, but they're, like, treating it like it's a, t a season of a TV show. It's very strange. <laughs> You're back from our exciting cliffhanger. It's like that was two minutes ago. 